As the doors open for dinner, customers are offered the regular menu in the dining room or the special barbecue menu served on the patio. At any time, you can just go up and start serving yourself. Roasted corn with chili lime butter. The colors and the smells, everything was vibrant and exciting. That looks so good. It's pretty phenomenal. It's a really good idea, though. While Keone oversees the barbecue, which is already generating excitement. I need shrimp. They're defrosting right now. Head chef Daniel and the kitchen staff are unfortunately stuck in their same old habits. What in the fuck is that? Cups and bags, cups and bags. I thought the only thing that went in bags were bodies. I hate those bags. Ugh. Oh, gross. So where's the fresh rice for tonight? We're using the same rice that we made yesterday. Oh, doctor's no. Fucking hell. I'm extremely frustrated. I wanted to make fresh beans and rice today. It was not the decision Dr. Morris wanted to make. We've got no fresh rice on there. OK. And apparently, doctor's orders are use the old rice in the bank. I I'm sorry. Oh. No. Hope they get our food out soon. <laughs> in spite of the frequent use of the microwave. Guys, it's been 20 minutes on a order of Rudy shrimp. We're just waiting for it. The kitchen struggles to get food out to their customers. I could have grown a beard by the time they bring my meal. In the dining room, the, the atmosphere was a little like down where the food kept taking so long. People just weren't generally happy. Whereas when I poked my head outside to the patio, people were laughing, they were having fun. It was almost like two different restaurants tonight. That was really good, uh, really good chicken. Kerry, great news. Look how popular the barbecue's becoming. Right. And that smell, mmm, nice. Makes you feel like you're back in Jamaica. <laughs> huh? From Jamaica to depressing. After what seemed like an eternity, customers in the dining room are finally receiving their food. <laughs> but it doesn't appear to be worth the wait. The fish is really dry. I think mm -hmm. it may be overcooked. Overcooked? OK, I'll let them know right now. What's wrong with that? They said it's too dry and overcooked. It's just gone out. Daniel. What? She just wants to try something else. What? Jesus, recommend the barbecue. We've got a stunning piece of salmon out there, cooked perfectly. You want to try that? Go and get it now, quickly. OK. Dry and overcooked. Is that still the, is that the frozen stuff? Yes, that's the frozen stuff. It's rubbery. She's absolutely right. Thoroughly frustrated, Chef Ramsay jumps into action and puts together an entree of barbecue salmon. Let's hope she enjoys. All right. Can't believe we're serving barbecue food in the dining room. There we are. Chef Ramsay plated it for you. Oh my God. So there you are. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Oh my God. That's so good. Oh, excuse me. How is that? It's great. Is it great? It's the barbecue. Oh my God. Next time, patio. Yeah. <laughs> Enjoy. Yeah, thank you. Do you know? Please. The smell. Yeah, it's beautiful. Fresh barbecue. <laughs> and the verse out here is wonderful. It's beautiful. I really appreciate good. it. Good, good, Thank good, good. You. Change is not easy, you know, but I was really impressed with how many people enjoy the barbecue tonight. So I'm willing to allow him to tell me how I can make it better. From Jamaica to Nino.